When I tell y'all, yes, yes, yes. Straight up, straight up. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. -hmm. mm, -hmm. mm. <clears throat> hey y'all, how y'all doing? It's your girl, Miss Natural Shay. Welcome or welcome back. Today, baby, we are on day number what? 43. 43 of my fragrance layering combo of the day diaries boo okay let's just <laughs> let's just jump right on in this thing okay all right so mm-hmm 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 yeah we using this for my base body bar dove turmeric milk and lemon drop when i tell you yes uh-huh smells good and it does the body good as well from the neck on down i use this matter of fact <laughs> I usually do the neck on down, but today I had to use it on my face yet again. I have used it on my face before and it does not cause any breakouts for me. So that's a plus. And so um, I have finished up my original uh, beauty bar from Dove uh, yesterday. So yeah, yesterday. So I had to go in with my, um, my turmeric milk and... <laughs> lemon drop uh plant-based body bar by dove i had to go in with that this morning i meant to go to the dollar tree to get some more dove bars or even to the walmart but i think the dollar tree is cheaper 125 because i know last time when i got a dove um original body bar it was 147 mm -hmm. i probably really should go to bj's but anyway um we're gonna keep on talking about you know my scent of the day so um, I use this basically from head, basically my whole face, uh, for skincare and as well as my body. And then y'all, I went in today with two body washes, boo. Mm -hmm. I've done this actually before, but I didn't, I don't think I ever, um, recorded that I did these two together, but I'm gonna let y'all see. Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Y'all already know how I feel about the uh personal care sugar cookie limited edition body wash and i do really enjoy this i like to pair it with my pampering shea beauty mm. <laughs> shea butter and vanilla uh body wash i really do love to pair these two together so i was like why not pair the vanilla noir shower gel with this and when i tell y'all it's another awesome time in the shower okay like they both do a very awesome job with the suds the you know foaming up all that great stuff um it's i scrub it up my body and i do use i don't use a bath cloth for scrubbing my body i use a um african net uh for that and there are some on amazon i don't know if you guys use the african net when I tell you the African net really gets you right, okay? Now, the bath cloth is cool for, like, my uh, uh, vagina area, my gingerbread area, and my buttocks area, and even my face. I will use it on my face, but, um, and, of course, separate ones. Like, I have two bath cloths, one's for my face, and one is for only my um, gingerbread and my butt. And then for my African net, so I have three things that I use for my whole entire body. And the African net, I use from the neck on down all the way to my toes. Like, I love the African net. I've had it for years. I even wash it and all that great stuff. I ain't had no issues. I ain't had no problems. I ain't had no, you know, craziness going on anywhere on my body. Um, And I love the African net. So, anywho, I use these two products. And when I tell you it was a good time, listen, the Vanilla Noir, baby. The Vanilla Noir, oh, I don't even have the, the Kinos on here, but I love, I'm, I'm trying to look for um something where I can show y'all what the Vanilla Noir has in it, but when I tell y'all, OMG, this bad boy smells so good, and when I also tell you this is from the men's section, it's from the men's section, and I have no shame in my game going to the men's section and getting this. Matter of fact, let me pause real quick so I can check out um i have a i have the vanilla noir spray so i'm gonna go ahead and grab that up okay so i have the vanilla noir spray and i did not use this today but i just wanted to bring this out so i could show you and these are the only two products i think no i actually had the cream as well <laughs> so i have all of these three from the men care line mm -hmm. i don't care 
that is from the men care line like this smells so good and if something smells good to me maybe i'm gonna grab it up okay no matter what they say oh it's the men care section mm -hmm. i'll be over there smelling it up and grabbing it up so anyway um the fragrance notes is rich vanilla bergamot spice and patchouli musk like baby when i tell you this is a good time this is a good time like for real Mm, it's such a good time to me and yeah mm -hmm, i do recommend for us ladies to go try the men's section and shout out to my girl sabrina hey girl our first lady i gotta give her props because she's the one that told me some years back girl go ahead and try you know what i'm saying go ahead and try you some um uh some men's uh, go to the men's section like the first one i think she told me about was the and i'm about to show y'all real quick was the um classic flannel yes and when i tell you i love this omg okay listen the fragrance notes for this is fresh bergamot patchouli spice and sweet amber when i tell you this is a good sign listen <laughs> oh my gosh and i don't even think they had the classic flannel anymore in the men's care line but whatever it is what it is okay y'all so back to me washing my body down in these two scents yes ma'am i did this all right so of course when we get out the shower i gotta dab 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 get all the excess water off and it's time to moisturize on down okay it's time to moisturize on down and this time i went in with my cozy fireside from body ecology i have not used this in a while and i do have a backup of this i do have a backup of this so y'all can see this bad boy is like the original bottle like this bad boy is almost done though I probably got about two more uses out of here, maybe even one. Who knows? But I paired it with my sugar cane, my sugar cane from the Body Pantry, y'all. Go check out thebodypantry.com. It's from my girl, Shanice Alicia, here on YouTube. Like, that's my girl. Like, she don't even know me, for real, for real. All she knows that I'm a subscriber. I always, um, not always. I can't say always because I watch a lot of people's videos and I do not always comment, but I do comment here and there. So she does know me probably by my, um, by just my face and my name or whatever, cause she sees me every now and then commenting cause she always comments back. Like I love that. And I love to comment back too. I love when you guys comment, but anyway, um, check out the body pantry .com. Follow my girl, Shanice Alicia here on YouTube and also on Instagram and TikTok. Okay. But yeah, the body pantry, when I tell you this is a good time, this is a good time. And right now I still have this much left in the bottle and I have two more, two more backups. So I'm good to go for a while. But when I tell y'all this is a good time, uh-huh, uh-huh, I do recommend. Listen, Cozy Fireside some more has been a, um, I would, I would say staple, but not really a staple, but it's been, it's been a number one in my collection for the Body Ecology. Really Body Ecology, I don't have much of Body Ecology right now with me. Um, all I have is this. I do have something else, dark cherry something like that but that's in the storage but anywho yes body ecology cozy fireside some more um i do recommend this and this was a good time uh when i moisturize on down okay all right so we don't we don't uh, uh showered we don't got the moisturization locked in okay now it's time to spray on down and i decided to use also the body ecology cozy fireside some more um spray and they have changed the bottles since since i have grabbed these up which has been at this point two plus years ago they have changed the bottles well not even two plus years ago um I, this is a re-up which i think i got this like either last year or it could have been two years ago but anyway since then they have changed the packaging and the packaging is cool um but yes this one the fragrance notes is smoky marshmallow sandalwood and chocolate and when i tell y'all yes 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 straight up straight up mm-hmm mm-hmm mm. <clears throat> when i tell y'all this is a good time y'all already know a lot of people out <coughs> excuse me it does every time a lot of people know about the cozy uh fire sauce s'more okay mm-hmm one of my good sis, I don't forget which one it was, put me on to this. It probably was Kimmy Cakes. If not, it could have been Sabrina. 
If not, I'm not sure who it was, but boo, thank you, whoever turned me on to this because it's a good time. Okay, so yeah, so spray that on down. Okay, now I'm going in with something else that's like smoky, and this is from the Dua uh, brand, and it's the Black Widow. And the Black Widow, I do need to tell you about this. Like, I need to go ahead. I'm using my iPad right now. I'm gonna go ahead and let y'all know where the Black Widow comes from for the Duo brand. And um, let me let y'all know because, uh, let me see, Black Widow. I've had this for a while, y'all. The Duo brand, okay. So, let me see, do they, okay, they still have it. It's actually a different, it, it doesn't look like this anymore. They don't change the packaging. And now the Black Widow looks like this. I don't even like that. For real, for real. It looks like very evil. But this, I mean, that does look better. But this is what it looks like now. But the inspiration is from Black Phantom by Killian. So it says the um it's a unisex it's a unisex scent so of course a male or female can wear this and it's a uh, note is dark rum and let me put it back up there dark rum sugarcane dark chocolate coffee caramel almond javanese or javanese vetiver helotrope and sandalwood when I tell y'all if y'all like smoky like for referral this to me is a very smoky scent and if y'all know about Black Phantom, which I really don't know nothing about besides smelling this. And if it smells like it, then, hey, why pay for the Black Phantom by Killian? Because I know Killian, I haven't had any of their, their fragrances. But I know that I'm sure it's it's up there for the price. You can get this um, at 1.1 ounce for, hold on, I don't even know because it's in. Mm, okay, hold on. $55. And if you got a 10, which is just like a sample size, it's $20. But a 34 mil, which is equal to a 1.1 fluid ounce, is $55 uh, from the Dua Brain. I enjoy the Dua Brain because you can get stuff um, just just like from Dossier. Uh, you can get stuff for the fraction of the price. But anyway, I just want y'all to know what uh, the Black Widow smells like or Black Widow smells like. All right, y'all, so I was not satisfied just by putting this on after I had my cozy uh, uh, fire, um, my cozy fireside some more, my um, vanilla noir, my, of course, another cozy side. Like, I wasn't, I wasn't, when I put all of this on and then I put my Black Widow on, I was like, okay, mm, something is missing. So I had to go in with my girl, my girl, Billie Eilish number two. Okay, we're gonna let's see what the keynotes is for this because I haven't I haven't talked about the keynotes for um the number two in a while. So Billie Eilish, let's go. All right, we're gonna go in. I love the first one that she did. It's it's top tier, top tier. Okay, so the Billie Eilish number two. This is actually a one a one point zero fluid ounce that I have here. And um, I got it from Ulta, but I do believe that Walmart, if you go to walmart.com, it is cheaper. Here, a one point fluid ounce is $52. If you get a 1.7 ounce, it is $62. And if you get a 3.4 ounce, it is $72. So make sure y'all check Walmart if y'all want to get this because Walmart usually is cheaper. Um, so anywho, I just want to tell you about the keynotes for this. So the keynotes, let's see here. It says it's a woody floral fragrance and it features notes of apple blossom, wild, wet poppy flowers, and Palo Santo. Palo Santo. So I think this is like a smoky scent too. I do believe to me, Black Widow is a more smokier scent. And I think it changed just a little bit um, because it's <laughs> this bad boy is over two years old. So it has changed a little bit with the scent. Um, but I did pair it with this, which is, of course, uh, 
Billie Eilish number two. And I think that everything like went well together. I really do. I really do. I really think that it went well together. Um, if I had, which I do not have, but if I did have the Billie Eilish uh, first one, which let's see real quick. The first one. Oh, hold on. I don't want to go back. Okay, here we go. The first one to me is like a cakey smell. It has notes of it's from the Amber Gourmand scent and the first one looks like this y'all that's what it looks like if y'all don't know i mean some people don't know so i'm putting y'all on of course um if y'all don't know so that one is just the eilish uh Ude perfume and it's a, a cap a captivating amber gourmand fragrance and it has the notes of sugared petals creamy vanilla and warm musk and when i tell you that one which i do have the um it's it's up here on the shelf but i do have that i want to keep it for just decoration um but when i tell you that's a good one too like if i had that one like still had some in the bottle because when i tell you i don't tore it up like i can't do it no more like i can't spray nothing else anymore but um that one smells really good as well and if i had that one i would have spray that too because i just need like a little bit of sweetness because to me even though this has some sweet um scent because i guess because it's a uh, a unisex scent it's like it to me it's more smoky than anything so um i topped this off with this one after i sprayed this one this is my last thing i topped off and like you know put on and i've really been enjoying the scent and when i tell y'all i can still smell it I can still smell it in my clothes, which is an awesome thing. Yeah. But anyway, guys, this is the end of my video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If y'all did, make sure y'all give me a big thumbs up. That lets me know you like these these types of videos. Make sure that you're chit-chatting down below because you know your good sis want to know what was your scent of the day, boo, okay? Thank you guys for commenting on my videos. Y'all know how much I love you guys. I love y'all so much. Like, baby, <laughs> we're here, okay? We are so here. I love you guys to the moon and beyond. And um, Stacy, thank you for your comment. I have not responded back to you, but you said that you enjoy our um, or <laughs> you enjoy my fragrance layering combos. Um, so I would definitely will continue these. Also, my good sis, um, forever. You also said the same thing that you enjoy those as well. And I still have to comment comment back to you guys. So don't think that I have forgotten about you guys. I know you're probably thinking this. I'm just, it's, I'm, I'm just all in my head. But I will um come back, comment back to you guys. I have um at least yesterday and today comments to go ahead and um do. So I will definitely do those. Uh, but yeah, I do appreciate every single comment that I get. I love y'all so much. Y'all make my heart melt. Like y'all make it so warm. Like, and I get so excited when I see a message from you guys because it just, it just, it just makes my day when I hear back from you guys. So I know that I'm doing something right. When I see a big thumbs up, when I see a message, like the message that right there, because sometimes we forget to a uh, thumbs up. Like I try to, when I watch people's videos, whoever I'm watching, the ones that I love to watch, like, it's not like it's a new video that I'm, 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 I'm gonna boop like it every time. I'm not gonna like it probably until I don't watch the whole thing. Um, if it's a new person that I've, like, started to watch. Um, but of course, if I do enjoy their content, I will definitely do a thumbs up. And if it's somebody that I've been watching for a, a while and I've been enjoying every video, you know what I'm saying? As soon as I start playing their video, I just go ahead and do my thumbs up because a lot of times I do forget to thumbs up. A lot of times I do not comment back. I mean, I do not comment on their videos. I watch so many people. It's just like, okay, I can't always say something. I mean, I probably should at least heart it, like put a heart in a comment so they know who's watching. Um, But that's just not how I roll like all the time. I don't be thinking about it, but I do love to make sure I'm liking it so that that helps them out and that they know that we are enjoying their content even if we don't comment because a lot of people 
um i do know we are like silent watchers like of course we don't always hey girl what's going on but over here i welcome all of that and i make sure that i comment back i don't care how long it's been since i haven't made a like haven't commented like no message goes um without me liking it or commenting because i have to do that so you guys know that i am reading everything and i enjoy the engagement with you guys but anyway y'all i don't held this up for too long maybe i don't took out 20 minutes of your time and no ma'am i am not going to edit this video you're gonna get what you get like this is the real deal like sometimes i do edit but a lot of times i don't edit i just whatever it is whatever it is y'all already know i like to talk <laughs> and i talk another hole in your head but anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, you already know what to do. Also, make sure that you are share, share, sharing this video with any and everyone. Why, boo? Huh? Why? Because it's free.net and it's free.com and it's free 99. Okay? That's it. That's all. All right, y'all. I love you guys for watching. And I will get you, catch you guys in tomorrow's video, which will be number 44. Okay? What? 44 double digit, baby. Anyway, <laughs> I'm simple. All right, y'all. Happy Friday. And I hope you all have a wonderful weekend. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.